All right, fellow collectors, this is Diffuser now. And today I'd like to show you my new man cave. I've just uh, recently moved in with my girlfriend and I just uh, I built my own man cave here. She had a spare room left, so uh, yeah, I just made my uh, own piece of uh, heaven here. In my, own, uh, in my own little world with all my collectibles. I used to have them in uh, separate rooms, but now I have uh, just one big room of my collectibles and other sweet things. As you can see here, I have my uh, Hot Toys collection. And here I have some Sideshow stuff. And some NECA Quarter Scale Predators. And this is my uh, TV setup with uh, the Dark Knight playing. It's one of my all time favorite movies. And this just happened to be one of my favorite scenes too. The hit me scene. It's just a fantastic movie, I loved it. I still do. Yes, it's fantastic. I can watch the movie all again. This is one of those films you can watch every fucking day. It's that good. But anyway, just just uh, let me show you my collection. And this is the Enterbake Water Skill Battle Damaged Terminator. And a half skill endoskull bust from uh, Hollywood Collectibles Group, I think it was. And here we have the Joker Premium Format statue by Sideshow. Awesome sculpt and a great paint job. And here we have the quarter skill Batman and Joker figures, also by Enter Bay. I cannot wait for the uh, quarter scale Batman from Hot Toys. I hope it will be here soon. Of course I pre-ordered it and I paid almost half of it, so uh, I expect it anytime soon. Don't know where to put it yet, but uh, I'll make some room for it. And here we have the Bandai Medicom Akira bike with uh, Tetsuan Kaneda. This is really a, a grill piece in my collection. And I'm really happy uh, to have this. Also have the exclusive decals here. Let me put on the... Oh. Yeah. With the sound effects and the light up feature. It's really an awesome bike. And like I said, it's really a, a, gr a grill piece in my collection. I'm glad to own it. And here is two legendary skill busts from uh, Spider-Man and Venom, of course, the exclusive versions. And my other cabinet here. We have the uh, quarter skill Predator figures by NECA. And here we have the Predator Legendary Skill Bust. Together with the Dutch Premium Format. With an awesome Arnold Schwarzenegger sculpt made by uh, Trevor Grove over at Sideshow. And he did an awesome job. Still think this is one of the best sculpts of Arnold uh, to date. Especially by Sideshow. Yeah, it's a great statue. 
And here we have the Naitiri statue from Avatar, also by Sideshow. And the Darth Talon premium format figure. Which is really expensive nowadays. I got it uh, uh, three years back, I think. Three years ago. For uh, 220 bucks, I think it was. And uh, now they're up to a thousand, or maybe 11 or 1200 on eBay. It's crazy. It's a real sexy uh, statue. And I think it looks great uh, next to my uh, Neytiri statue. And here we have my Hot Toys collection. With all my uh, Dark Knight figures on top. Yeah, you've seen the video. It's my Avengers setup. Some Iron Man figures. superheroes from Marvel and from DC Superman and I've just recently got the Agent Coulson figure this is not the, the definitive setup because I don't like uh, this setup with uh, Scarface and uh, Barney Ross uh, next to him so I'll be placing him uh, somewhere else soon but I really don't have room for him anymore so just have to figure it out. Maybe uh, I'll just get a new detail soon. I don't know. And here we have Kamui from the uh, Kamui Gaiden uh, movie. It's a really rare figure. You don't see very often. But it's awesome. It's got a great sculpt. And of course Indiana Jones and Jack Sparrow. 89 Batman and Joker figures. My Terminator setup. And two Predators. And this is a uh, promo promotional piece from uh, the Dark Knight Rises movie. And here we have my computer setup. I used to make some uh, electronic music uh, back in the day, so I still have some stuff left as you can see. Like my monitor speakers, my MIDI keyboard, and uh, some other stuff. But I don't uh, make uh, music anymore. My uh, computer is a bit outdated. And uh, yeah, I don't know, it was, it, was, it was just a part of my life uh, back in the day and uh, I don't feel the urge to make uh, music anymore, but uh, maybe I'll get a new computer someday and uh, I'll pick it up, because uh, I kind of miss it sometimes. And I really get some uh, inspiration from some new artists, so uh, maybe I'll pick it up sometime, don't know yet. So yeah guys, this is uh, my new man cave, hope you uh, have enjoyed the ride, and uh, like Nanny D always says. But soon I will be uh, moving again, we've just recently bought a house together, me and my girlfriend. So this will probably be the last video of this man cave, and I will be making a huge man cave in uh, our new home soon, maybe in a couple of months. I'm really excited to, uh, to live together with my girlfriend over there because it's really an awesome place and uh, it's like a dream house. So yeah, just can't wait. But for now, I hope to see you guys soon on the tube. And like I said, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, video of my man cave setup. So yeah, this is Diffusion L signing out.